I'm Carrie Kirkham and you're Sipping with the Wine Fox. With me today is 2016 La Crema Sonoma Coast Chardonnay. It's in the $15 range, give or take a few dollars. And I must admit, I love to taste and review wines that are commonly available. And this one is available at most grocery stores and wine retailers. And I like that because a lot of times the wines are very predictably good, and in this case, it is predictably good. It's a blend of hand and machine harvested Sonoma Coast Chardonnay, and it comes from these vineyards. There are quite a few, so rather than ramble them all off, uh, here they are. Sara Lee's Vineyard is one of my favorites. Uh, the Chardonnay and the Pinot out of uh, Sara Lee Vineyard in the Vineyard Designate release of La Crema is pretty spectacular. And there are even a variety of clones in this Chardonnay. Look at all these clones. Pretty amazing. There are a lot of clones in this Chardonnay, and this is an everyday, you can find anywhere Chardonnay. The wine was aged for eight months in primarily French with some American oak, 17% of which was new. But this wine underwent lees stirring every one to two months as it was aging, and that's pretty interesting for an everyday Chardonnay you can find everywhere. The fact that it underwent batonage, pretty cool if you ask me. Mm. But what does it taste like? I get juicy red apple, I get pear, I get this apricot in the finish and little bits of spice, like warm baking spices, and just a little zing of lemon zest in the finish. It's lovely, 13.5% alcohol. I like it. It's a solid everyday Chardonnay for everyone. Very easy to drink, eminently drinkable. La Crema has tasting rooms in Windsor and also just off the square in Healdsburg. I've been to the tasting room in Windsor. It's at the Sara Lee Vineyard Estate and it was so inviting, very enjoyable space. So I highly recommend it. And to that, I say cheers and carpe uvum.